name is Isabella. Hi, my name is Lydia. And we're going to show you how to take DNA from anything living. You will need green split peas, um, one eighth tea tablespoon of salt, a cup of cold water, meat tenderizer, laundry detergent, one skewer, table salt, and rubbing alcohol. Lastly, a blender. You can also use this experiment with spinach, chicken liver, strawberries, and broccoli. Okay. First step is to put one half a cup of split peas into the blender. Next, put one eighth of a teaspoon table of table salt in the blender. Then one cup of cold water. Blend it for 15 seconds. Now that you have blended your peas, pour your thin pea cell soup through a strainer into another container, like a measuring cup. Add two tablespoons of liquid detergent into, and swirl into the mix. Let the mixture sit for 5 to 10 minutes. Pour the mixture into the test tubes or other small glass containers, each about one third full. Add a pinch of enzymes to each test tube and stir gently. Be careful, if you stir too hard, you break up the DNA, making it hard to see. Tilt your test tube and slowly pour rubbing alcohol, 70, 95 percent, um, or ethyl alcohol, into the tube down the side so that it forms a layer on top of the pea mixture. Pour it until you have about the same amount of alcohol in the tube as the pea mixture. Alcohol is less dense than water, so it floats on the top. Look for clumps of white stringy stuff where the water and alcohol layers meet. DNA is a long stringy molecule. The salt that you added in step one helps it stick together. So what, do you, what, so what you see are clumps of tangled DNA molecules. And that's how you extract DNA from anything living. I hope you enjoyed.